what's up you guys so as you can tell this isn't my uh typical background or location you know uh first of all i'm sorry if the lighting in this is super bad i am filming on my vlog camera not my regular camera second i'm sorry if there's really bad background noise there's like bugs and stuff and dogs and people talking so this is like the most peace and quiet i could get i just kind of wanted to film a little experience video or whatever with you guys um on harry styles because i saw him last week and i kind of just want to talk about the whole experience because it was really like i don't know like kind of like something i needed to experience if that makes sense at all so i'm just gonna like dive in and i'm gonna show you guys some clips about everything that happened tell you what happened and all that so i saw harry styles june 30th 2018 yeah we're in 2018 and i saw him in chicago beginning of the day i got really early downtown i was there at about uh like 11 a.m. I got there. Yeah, I got there about like noon. I want to say noon 11. So anyways, I got dropped off at my friend's hotel Whatever I hung out with her and then afterwards me and my friend Leslie a lot of you guys know her We did a vlog together on here. We walked to Harry's hotel Which we just kind of assumed was his hotel because there was pictures of him there. So we're like, it's okay That's like probably his hotel, right? So we walked there around like I met up with her like three o'clock we met up and we walked to his hotel. We were waiting there for maybe like not even 10 minutes. It wasn't even that long. So we're waiting at his hotel. We're like looking for the hotel first of all. And we can't find it. I have it in my maps like for walking. And I can't find this damn hotel. And I'm like where the hell is it? Like it's super like low key and all that. And I couldn't find it. And these girls were like are you looking for Harry? And we're like yeah. And they were I think they said they were from like Portugal or something. Which so like girl what are you doing here? like okay like i guess if you want yeah so like these girls they pretty much were just like following us because they're like oh well they probably like know where he is or whatever and i mean we did we get to the hotel there was maybe like another 10 15 people it really wasn't that many because probably just because like nobody knew where he was staying this was just like a wild guess and everyone else was like getting like kicked off the property because i guess maybe like he was gonna come out or whatever Oh, there's my grandma in the back. Yeah. yeah. I'm making a video. Oh, are you are you done? Dude. Interrupting my story time. Anyways, I'm just gonna do this while she's here. Don't get distracted. I'm sorry. Let me just go right like that so you can get distracted so like the building for this hotel it's like an open thing like it's like i don't want to like expose what it was because if he does stay there in the future i don't want it to be exposed but this place is very exclusive i should say um so that's that and it has two entrances one is like the main entrance and then the other is like kind of like a side door to a restaurant that it has and people were waiting like by the main door and we walked all the way to the side door and it was just me and leslie so we didn't look like suspicious like we're looking for him and we just like i don't know we weren't looking like fangirls if that makes sense i don't know and um we were just like standing there i was eating my hot fries and looking at the menu because i was really hungry so i was looking through the menu through the window and everyone else like they're being told like oh you got to get off the property you got to like move it skedaddle while that's happening we see a sprinter van right next to us and it's an suv like an uber black basically which like in my long line of being a fangirl i know that uber black is basically like like not uber black but like the suvs the black suvs that they use for like uber black whatever i think like the range rovers or whatever those are the sprinter vans that they use justin Bieber uses them youtubers use them everyone uses them and one thing that i check is the license plate because okay ladies and gents this is an important key if you ever want to meet someone a yellow license plate it's usually like a yellow orange tint i don't know like everywhere else but in chicago rental cars in chicago will have an orange slash yellow license plate and that's how i knew so i checked it and i was like okay it's orange it's a it's a rental Ooh. so i was like okay this is probably his sprinter van so let's just wait right here let's just like not make a scene let's just whatever we'll wait if he comes out he comes out because and there was like people from his team i don't know maybe it was security maybe it was his manager i'm not familiar with his team or anything i'm not that deep into it 
and we saw him he was like looking around like just like searching about like okay like where's like a lot of people where's not you know and he like i don't know and i saw him like talking to like the other guys i was like okay maybe they're gonna be like maybe he's like gonna come out soon or whatever so anyways a few more minutes pass we are sitting there i am facing so let me tell you how this works so i am facing the front let's pretend i'm here in front of me is leslie and behind her to like the right like the back is the door the the side door i guess you could say and then there's a window next to it and i was looking through the window at the menu because i wanted food and i was contemplating i'm buying an 11 dollar turkey sub so i'm looking through the menu and i'm just like not really paying attention to like what's going on at all and i hear the door open i don't think anything about it because i'm like oh it's probably just someone walking out whatever i see someone and a white shirt it's not until i see the back of his head and i realize it's harry it's harry fucking styles okay and i don't notice until i see the back of his hair i see his curly long hair and i see the tattoos all that and i realize it's harry and i literally like he was like Bloom! like he was in Bloom! can't see me bitch bye like it, he was going that fast to his car he just went Shoo! I didn't even have like time to think like right when I realized it was Harry I didn't even have time to be like hi or like whatever like I had no time to react I was kind of like in shock at that point to be honest I was literally like I was literally like shocked to see him there I like did not speak I was like like dead ass I just I didn't know what to do Hey, okay, my grandma's back <laughs> she's yeah me a thumbs up for my grandma and i was just in so much shock like i couldn't believe and then he got in his car they closed the door and i like tried like waving to him but i was like okay baby she, like he don't see you you know like he doesn't see you but i don't know i was like waving and, like and then when he like got into his car i was like staring at like his security guard for like like this is me at the security guard. i'm just like like bro like really like you couldn't have like said anything like because the thing is, it was only the two of us when that, like, actually happened. It's not like everyone else saw him and, like, boarded his car, you know? It's not like people saw him and they all, like, attacked him. Like, it was literally only me and Leslie that saw him. So if I saw him sooner, I could have, like, stopped him for a second and, like, talked to him. Or even, like, took a picture or, like, anything, like, small. But, like, I didn't. So, like, I can't even say I'm at her stuff. I can't even say I interact with him. Like, I literally just saw him and he was so close to me that's like oh that's the part i like regret and it's like he was literally right there if i only noticed like if i was just staring at the door when he came out i could have like said something okay and that's like what makes me so mad and yeah but after that they left and i assumed they went to the arena and all that after that we just went back to the hotel that we were at and from there we ubered to the united center we waited for like a good I don't know like four hours because the show was eight i did not see his opening act i think it was casey musgraves i think i honestly i'm sorry directioners don't attack me and harry honestly to put it like a great performer guys like a really great performer like his stage presence like so hype like literally so hype and he's so funny like when he i didn't expect him to like interact with the crowd that much i don't know because like I don't know but he did and he's like super funny like he's really funny let me just like put some clips of him being like funny and like iconic real quick just so you guys can like witness that because like that was great you don't know what's wrong what can i do You've been texting most of the time. So, standing at the front on the old. What's Janet saying? What's Janet saying? What's she saying? I don't know, Janet. It's how we make up a name. Are you all together you texting each other? Alright, I hope you're enjoying the show. It's going on. Have a good time. How are you? Nice to see you. Nice to see you all. How are you doing? Are you all right? You good? How are you? Good. Who is from Chicago? Tonight, 
performances were wild like kiwi live mm. Mm. all i can say mm. i loved uh carolina woman like literally oh it was so beautiful and when he was walking to stage b like stage b like the like little walkway to like get there it was like pretty close to me it wasn't like super like far i was at the end of my like i was at the aisle and then it was only like uh i think four seats but they wouldn't like let me like move there when he like came out but so it was like so close and it was so cool and this is actually a shirt that i got let me like stand up a little bit oh let me model it so this shirt 
It's got Rubik's cubes and his hands. Really? She's not out here. And I got this for 40 and then I got the Kiwi crew neck, which I don't have with me. It's $60 and I love it because I like Kiwi. Oh, my highlight looks so good. Oh, who is she? Oh, oh. Let me just put like a few more clips of like the show for you guys to see and like some photos and uh, yeah. sell unwatermarked ones because I need to make money and they're like professional quality so like I'll sell them for like I think I'm doing like five bucks for the photos each and like do that through like PayPal or Cash App I don't know your girl gotta eat so yeah can everyone leave I'm gonna put this in there as a blooper can everyone everyone's here and bothering me but I'm at the end of the video so it's fine I'm just on the outro so with that being said if you guys like this video, please give me a 
thumbs up. If you liked my grandma being in the video 90% of the time, give me a thumbs yeah. up. If you like the background, because she's cute or whatever, give me a thumbs up. <laughs> subscribe if you're not already. You can, like, go down there and press subscribe and press the bell button so you know when I post. Every Saturday now, because we changed it. And share it with someone you think would like the video. You know, like your neighbor, your mom, your mom's friend, your cousin, your Facebook friend, your Facebook mutuals. Friends, friends of friends. You know, Harry Styles stands. Yeah. And that is it. I will see you guys hopefully next week, even though it's going to be hectic here because I'm here for a month. So I'm going to be doing my best to get out content and stuff on time for you guys. So we're going to see how this works. So I will see you soon. Peace out. Cause if you like